Today, we're fitting a Valent Ecotech Pure Combi in this very awkward location in the kitchen unit. And we're fitting it with a rear flue. Uh, we've got our bracket on the wall. And now what we're gonna do, we've put our flue through. We're gonna check the sides. We're gonna put it to the right position. Like so. And now what we need to do is measure and mark where we need to cut this flue. So it needs to be a minimum of 24 millimeters and a maximum of 28. So let's put it at 25. So now that we've got our markings where we need to cut, just gonna clean this up a bit. I use one of the, the straps here just to get an even marking around so let's just draw a line around here like so right let's take that off get our grinder i should be wearing safety goggles but Excellent. Now that I've done nice little tapered edges so that it slips nicely into our rubber washer, rubber seal and doesn't catch on the edges, I'm just going to smoothen this up with my knife. Now we're going to stick this in from the next area. Right, that's in. Let's just make sure that we're not exceeding 28 mil.
25, 25, 25. Perfect. So all that's left to do here now is put the securing screws in. Now we're gonna stick one on the top here. I'm going to put one over here. And one more on this side. There we go. Now we're going to get some good old lubricant and we're going to put some of this around the inner and outer glue. So again, it slips in nice and easy. Excellent. So now we're going to prepare what? our boiler and fit all of the valves and connections because they're not going to be very easy to do once the boiler's on the wall. And then we're going to get the boiler on. Okay, so now I've got all the uh, valves fitted to the bottom of the boiler. We're going to remove this blanket, flue blanking plate. Switch that out. And once again, put some we can just round the rubber seals. We can get our boiler on the wall. And there she goes. And now what's left is to fit our securing screw in the top here. Pop that in there. And there we go. Now we just got to pipe her up. 